Welcome to this Okta support video on how to configure provisioning for OAuth share file integration. In this video, we'll walk you through step-by-step -step instructions on how to set up OAuth and REST share file integration with Okta. By following this guide, you'll be able to create an administrator account in ShareFile, generate your API keys, configure your OAuth consumer key and consumer secret, authenticate your ShareFile integration with Okta, and enable ShareFile provisioning. Before we dive into the steps, let's quickly go over why you need to configure your ShareFile integration with Okta. To enable provisioning with ShareFile, you need to create an administrator account in ShareFile and generate your API keys. If you haven't configured basic credentials, admin, username, and password previously and haven't configured OAuth credentials yet, you'll get an invalid API credentials error for any provisioning operation. Now let's take a look at the steps to configure OAuth and REST ShareFile integration with Okta. Step 1. Create an administrator account in ShareFile. First, create an account in ShareFile that you will use to create the OAuth consumer key and consumer secret used in configuring ShareFile provisioning. Step 2. Generate your API keys. Log in to this URL here with the ShareFile admin account created in the previous step. Click on Get an API key and then Create New. Give your integration a name. Enter this URL for the redirect URI. And click Generate API Key. You will see your API keys as a table. Copy the client ID and client secret. They will be used to configure provisioning later. Step 3. Configure your OAuth consumer key and consumer secret. Log in as an admin user to the Okta admin dashboard. Select the provisioning tab for the share file integration. Then under settings, click configure API integration. Then select the enable API integration checkbox. Finally, enter your OAuth consumer key and OAuth consumer secret. Step 4. Authenticate your ShareFile integration with Okta. Click Authenticate with ShareFile. This will open a new window at the following URL. Enter your account's subdomain. Click Continue. Then enter the ShareFile administrator username and password that was used to create the OAuth key. Finally, Click Save to save the changes. Congratulations! Your ShareFile integration is now authenticated for provisioning. Note that Push Profile Update is supported only for first name and last name fields. That's it for this video on how to configure provisioning for OAuth ShareFile integration. We hope this guide was helpful for you. Don't forget to check back on Okta's support playlist often for more helpful videos. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please don't hesitate to reach out to Okta support.